The Book of Metaphysics for Daily Life, Practical Applications of Timeless Philosophies. Have you ever wondered why some people seem to glide effortlessly through life, while others struggle with the weight of every challenge? Is it merely chance, or is there something deeper, something hidden beneath the surface of reality that influences the way our lives unfold? Imagine, for a moment, that the world you see, the events you experience, and the people you interact with are not as fixed and immutable as you believe. What if, instead, everything is fluid, malleable, shaped not only by external forces, but also by your thoughts, beliefs, and perceptions? It's an intriguing proposition, one that opens the door to an entirely different way of living, one where you are no longer a passive participant in the grand drama of life, but rather an active creator, consciously sculpting your reality from the raw material of your own consciousness. The world we live in is one of patterns, cycles, and rhythms. These invisible threads weave together the fabric of our lives, often in ways we do not fully understand. Yet, if we could see these patterns, if we could comprehend the unseen forces that shape our experiences, we would gain access to a profound level of understanding, a level where we could begin to influence the course of our lives with deliberate intent. This is where metaphysics steps in, not as a collection of abstract philosophical musings, but as a practical guide to living. The ancient wisdom of metaphysical traditions teaches us that the nature of reality extends far beyond the physical world we perceive with our senses. It suggests that there are laws, unseen, unspoken, but incredibly powerful, that govern not only the material world but also the inner world of thoughts, emotions, and intentions. Consider, for example, the power of perception. Every day, we encounter situations that challenge our understanding, provoke our emotions, and sometimes leave us feeling overwhelmed. Yet, two people can experience the same event in entirely different ways. One may see a setback as a failure, something to lament and avoid in the future, while another sees the same event as an opportunity for growth, a chance to learn and adapt. This difference in perspective is not just a matter of attitude, it's a manifestation of a deeper metaphysical principle. What we perceive as reality is not fixed, it is shaped by our thoughts, beliefs, and expectations. The stories we tell ourselves about the world, about who we are and what is possible, become the lens through which we view reality. And, crucially, that lens can be altered. Imagine if you could shift your perception at will, choosing to see possibilities where others see limitations, or peace where others find chaos. What kind of power would that give you in navigating the challenges of daily life? This is not about denying reality or ignoring the hardships that inevitably arise, but about understanding that the way we interpret and respond to these events is, in itself, a creative act. The first step in mastering this art of perception is recognizing that we are not simply passive observers of the world around us. We are, in a very real sense, co-creators of our experiences. And this creative power lies not in changing the external world directly, but in transforming the inner world of thought and belief. One of the most profound realizations we can come to is that the mind is not just a processor of information, but a powerful tool of creation. Every thought you think, every belief you hold, sends ripples into the fabric of reality, shaping the world in ways both subtle and profound. This is the essence of metaphysics, understanding that the mind is not separate from the world, but deeply intertwined with it. The thoughts we nurture become the seeds of our future experiences, and the beliefs we hold form the foundation upon which our lives are built. If we wish to change our outer world, we must first tend to the inner one. This understanding opens up a realm of incredible possibilities. When we recognize that we have the power to influence our reality through our thoughts and beliefs, we can begin to approach life with a sense of empowerment and responsibility. No longer are we at the mercy of external circumstances, tossed about by the whims of fate. Instead, we become deliberate creators, consciously shaping our lives in alignment with our highest intentions. 
This shift in perspective is not just theoretical, it has profound practical implications for how we live each day. It means that instead of reacting to life's challenges with frustration or despair, we can approach them with curiosity and openness, knowing that within every obstacle lies the potential for growth and transformation. But how do we begin to harness this creative power? The answer lies in awareness. Awareness is the key that unlocks the door to metaphysical understanding. By becoming aware of the thoughts we think, the beliefs we hold, and the stories we tell ourselves about the world, we can begin to see where we are limiting ourselves and where we have the opportunity to grow. This process of self-inquiry is not always easy, it requires a willingness to look honestly at our own minds, to confront the fears and doubts that may be holding us back. But it is through this process that we gain the clarity and insight needed to create lasting change. As you embark on this journey of self-awareness, it is important to remember that you are not alone. The wisdom of metaphysical traditions has been passed down through the ages, offering guidance and insight to those who seek a deeper understanding of life. From the ancient philosophers of Greece and India to modern-day thought leaders, there is a wealth of knowledge available to help you navigate this path. And while the principles of metaphysics may be ancient, their applications are more relevant than ever in today's fast-paced, often chaotic world. In a time where we are bombarded with information and distractions, the ability to cultivate a calm, focused mind is a priceless skill. By applying the timeless principles of metaphysics, you can learn to quiet the noise of the external world and tune into the deeper, more meaningful currents of your inner world. The journey you are about to embark on is not one of abstract theory or distant ideals. It is a journey of practical application, a path that will show you how to take the timeless wisdom of metaphysics and apply it to your daily life. Whether you are facing challenges in your career, relationships, health, or personal growth, the tools and insights you will discover here can help you navigate these challenges with grace and wisdom. You will learn how to shift your perception, harness the power of your thoughts, and align yourself with the deeper forces that shape your reality. This is not a journey for the faint of heart, it requires courage, commitment, and a willingness to look beyond the surface of things. But for those who are ready, it offers the potential for profound transformation, both within and without. Chapter 1. Metaphysics and Perception Imagine a world where the very fabric of reality is not determined by the external conditions we face but by the way we perceive those conditions. It's a radical thought, isn't it? Yet, this is the essence of one of the most profound and practical metaphysical principles, the idea that our perception shapes our reality. To grasp this concept fully, we need to move beyond the simplistic notion that perception is merely a passive act of observing what is. Instead, we must come to understand perception as a dynamic force, one that not only interprets the world around us but also creates it. In this way, the world we inhabit is not a fixed, objective reality but an ongoing co-creation between our inner states and the external environment. At the core of this idea is the recognition that the mind does not simply receive information about the world, it actively constructs that world based on the information it receives. Every sensory input we process, what we see, hear, feel, taste, and smell, is filtered through a complex web of thoughts, beliefs, emotions, and experiences. These internal filters shape not only how we interpret events, but also what events we pay attention to in the first place. Two people may walk down the same street, but one might notice the vibrant colors of the flowers blooming in a nearby garden while the other fixates on the cracks in the sidewalk. Their experiences of the same external reality are profoundly different, and it is their perception that dictates these differences. But the influence of perception goes even deeper than this. It is not just about how we interpret the world, it is about how we actively participate in shaping it. This participation is subtle but powerful. When we hold certain beliefs about ourselves or the world, those beliefs influence our actions, which in turn shape the outcomes we experience. 
For example, if you believe that success is something you are not worthy of, that belief will guide your actions, perhaps causing you to avoid taking risks or pursuing opportunities, and those actions will lead to a life that confirms your belief. On the other hand, if you believe that you are capable of achieving great things, that belief will inspire you to take bold steps and seize opportunities, leading to a life that reflects your inner confidence. This is where the true power of perception lies, in its ability to shape not only our inner world, but also the external world we experience. The great spiritual and philosophical traditions have long understood this principle. In ancient India, the concept of Maya refers to the illusory nature of the physical world, suggesting that what we perceive as solid and unchangeable is, in fact, fluid and subject to the influence of consciousness. Similarly, in the teachings of Buddhism, the idea that all is mind points to the understanding that reality is a reflection of our mental states. Even modern science, through the study of quantum mechanics, has revealed that the act of observation can influence the behavior of particles, suggesting that consciousness itself plays a role in shaping the physical world. When we begin to see perception in this light, as an active force in the creation of reality, our relationship with the world around us changes. No longer are we passive recipients of whatever life throws our way. Instead, we become conscious creators, capable of influencing the trajectory of our lives through the choices we make about how we perceive and interpret our experiences. This shift in perspective is empowering, but it also comes with a great deal of responsibility. It means that we can no longer blame our circumstances or external events for the state of our lives. Instead, we must look inward and recognize the role our perceptions play in shaping the reality we experience. To apply this understanding in daily life, we must first cultivate awareness of our own perceptions. This requires us to become conscious of the stories we tell ourselves about who we are, what we are capable of, and what the world is like. These stories are often so ingrained that we may not even realize we are telling them. They may have been passed down to us by our parents, shaped by our cultural background, or formed through our early life experiences. But whether we are aware of them or not, these stories act as the lens through which we view the world, and they have a profound impact on our reality. For example, consider the story of scarcity versus abundance. Many people operate under the belief that the world is a place of scarcity, where there is never enough time, money, love, or resources to go around. This belief shapes their perceptions and leads them to focus on lack and limitation. They may avoid taking risks or sharing what they have for fear of losing it, and as a result, their lives become a reflection of this scarcity mindset. On the other hand, those who believe in abundance, that there is enough for everyone and that opportunities are limitless, will perceive the world in a completely different way. They will be more likely to take chances, to give freely, and to trust that their needs will be met. And, in many cases, their reality will mirror this belief in abundance, as opportunities seem to flow effortlessly into their lives. The good news is that these stories are not set in stone. Once we become aware of the limiting beliefs and perceptions that shape our reality, we can begin to change them. This process of shifting perception is not always easy, it requires effort, introspection, and often a willingness to challenge deeply held beliefs. But it is a process that is well worth undertaking, for as we change our perceptions, we change our reality. One of the most powerful tools for shifting perception is the practice of mindfulness. Mindfulness teaches us to observe our thoughts and feelings without judgment, creating a space between the stimulus of external events and our habitual reactions to them. In this space, we gain the freedom to choose a new way of seeing and responding. Instead of being swept along by our automatic thoughts and conditioned perceptions, we can pause, reflect, and consciously choose how we want to perceive a given situation. This practice allows us to move from reactive to proactive living, where we are no longer at the mercy of our unconscious perceptions but are actively shaping the way we experience the world. Another powerful practice for shifting perception is gratitude. 
Gratitude shifts our focus from what is lacking in our lives to what is already present and abundant. When we practice gratitude, we train our minds to see the good in every situation, no matter how challenging it may appear on the surface. This shift in perception has a profound impact on our reality, as it opens us up to new possibilities and helps us attract more of what we appreciate into our lives. Gratitude is not just a feel-good practice, it is a powerful tool for reshaping our inner and outer worlds. In addition to mindfulness and gratitude, another key practice for changing perception is the conscious use of language. The words we use to describe our experiences have a significant impact on how we perceive them. For example, when we describe a challenge as a problem, we automatically frame it in a negative light, which influences our perception of the situation and our ability to handle it. But if we describe the same challenge as an opportunity, we open ourselves up to the possibility of growth and transformation. By choosing our words carefully, we can begin to shift our perceptions and, in turn, change the way we experience reality. It's important to note that shifting perception is not about denying or ignoring the difficulties we face. Life will always present us with challenges, and it is not realistic or healthy to pretend otherwise. Rather, shifting perception is about expanding our view of reality so that we can see both the challenges and the opportunities that exist within every situation. It is about recognizing that, while we may not always have control over external events, we do have control over how we perceive and respond to them. As we begin to take control of our perceptions, we also start to take control of our destiny. By consciously choosing how we see the world, we influence the actions we take, the people we attract into our lives, and the opportunities that come our way. In this sense, perception is not just a passive process of observing reality, it is an active process of creating it. The more we cultivate awareness of our perceptions and consciously choose to see the world in ways that empower us, the more we begin to experience a reality that reflects our highest potential. This is the power of metaphysics in daily life, the realization that reality is not fixed, that it is constantly being shaped by our thoughts, beliefs, and perceptions. When we understand this, we gain access to a level of power and creativity that most people never tap into. We become the architects of our own lives, consciously shaping our experiences in alignment with our deepest desires and highest intentions. Ultimately, the journey of mastering perception is a lifelong process. It requires ongoing awareness, practice, and a willingness to challenge the stories we tell ourselves about the world. But as we continue on this path, we begin to see the profound impact that our perceptions have on every aspect of our lives. We realize that we are not victims of circumstance, but powerful creators of our own reality. And with this realization comes a sense of freedom, empowerment, and peace that transforms not only our inner world, but the outer world as well. Chapter 2. The Law of Cause and Effect At the heart of many spiritual and metaphysical traditions lies the understanding of the law of cause and effect, a principle that extends beyond the simple notion of action and reaction to encompass the very fabric of reality itself. This concept, often referred to as karma in Eastern philosophies, operates as a fundamental force that binds all experiences, shaping the outcomes of our lives in ways that we may not always perceive or understand at first glance. Yet, when we delve into this idea more deeply, we begin to recognize its profound implications, not just as a rule of the physical universe, but as a spiritual and metaphysical law that governs the creation of our reality on both a conscious and subconscious level. At its most basic level, the law of cause and effect is simple, every action has a corresponding reaction. In the physical world, this is easy to observe. If you drop a stone into a pond, ripples spread outward from the point of impact. If you plant a seed in fertile soil, it will grow into a plant under the right conditions. These examples are clear, tangible, and rooted in our everyday experience. However, this same principle applies not only to the physical actions we take but also to the thoughts we think, the emotions we feel, 
and the intentions we hold. Each of these mental and emotional actions sends ripples into the fabric of reality, influencing the outcomes and experiences that return to us. This is where the power of this metaphysical law becomes truly transformative. The actions we take in the physical world are merely the tip of the iceberg. Beneath the surface, our thoughts, beliefs, and emotional states are constantly shaping the energy we emit into the universe, and this energy, in turn, attracts corresponding experiences back into our lives. If our thoughts are filled with fear, doubt, and negativity, we are likely to attract experiences that mirror these internal states. Conversely, when we cultivate thoughts of love, gratitude, and abundance, we draw those qualities into our reality. This is the essence of the law of cause and effect as it applies to our spiritual and metaphysical existence, what we put out into the world, whether through action, thought, or feeling, is what we will ultimately receive in return. One of the most challenging aspects of understanding this principle is recognizing the ways in which our thoughts and beliefs, often operating on a subconscious level, create patterns in our lives that reinforce themselves over time. Many people live their lives unaware of the hidden beliefs and mental habits that shape their experiences. They may see themselves as victims of circumstance, unaware that their internal world is constantly creating the external conditions they face. This is why becoming conscious of our thoughts and beliefs is one of the most important steps we can take in transforming our lives. When we become aware of the thoughts that drive our actions and the beliefs that shape our perceptions, we gain the power to change them, and in doing so, we change the trajectory of our lives. Imagine, for a moment, that your mind is a garden. The thoughts you think and the emotions you feel are the seeds you plant in that garden. Some seeds will grow into beautiful flowers, while others will grow into weeds, depending on the quality of the seeds you plant and the care you give them. If you plant seeds of fear, doubt, and anger, your garden will be overrun with the weeds of negativity. But if you plant seeds of love, gratitude, and faith, your garden will bloom with abundance and joy. The law of cause and effect operates in much the same way, the seeds we plant in the fertile soil of our minds will grow into the experiences we encounter in the world around us. However, it is important to recognize that the law of cause and effect does not operate in a simplistic, one-to-one -one fashion. Life is not a vending machine where you insert a coin of positive thought and immediately receive a reward of positive experience. The effects of our thoughts, actions, and emotions are often delayed, and they may manifest in ways that are not immediately apparent. This is why patience and persistence are essential when working with this principle. Just as a seed does not sprout the moment it is planted, the thoughts we think today may take time to manifest in our reality. But rest assured, the seeds we plant will eventually bear fruit, for this is the law of the universe. Another important aspect of the law of cause and effect is the understanding that it applies to both individuals and the collective. The actions we take, the thoughts we think, and the energy we emit not only affect our own lives, but also the lives of those around us and the world as a whole. We are not isolated beings, existing in a vacuum. We are all interconnected, part of a vast web of energy and consciousness that spans the entire universe. This means that the causes we set in motion, whether positive or negative, have a ripple effect that extends far beyond our individual lives. Our actions, thoughts, and feelings contribute to the collective consciousness of humanity, influencing the overall direction of the world. This understanding brings with it a profound sense of responsibility. When we recognize that our thoughts, actions, and intentions have the power to shape not only our own reality but also the reality of those around us, we begin to see the importance of living with conscious intention. Every thought we think, every word we speak, and every action we take sends ripples into the collective energy field, contributing to the creation of our shared reality. This is why it is so important to cultivate positive thoughts, compassionate actions, and loving intentions, not only for our own benefit but for the benefit of all beings.
But how do we begin to align ourselves with the law of cause and effect in a way that serves our highest good? The first step is awareness. We must become conscious of the thoughts, beliefs, and emotions that drive our actions. This requires a willingness to look honestly at ourselves and to take responsibility for the reality we have created thus far. It is not always easy to admit that we are the authors of our own experience, especially when that experience includes pain, struggle, or hardship. But it is only by taking responsibility for our current reality that we can begin to create a new one. Once we have cultivated awareness, the next step is to consciously choose the causes we want to set in motion. This means aligning our thoughts, actions, and emotions with the reality we wish to create. If we want to experience more love in our lives, we must think loving thoughts, speak loving words, and take loving actions. If we want to experience more abundance, we must cultivate a mindset of abundance, act from a place of generosity, and trust that the universe will provide for us. This process requires practice, patience, and persistence, but over time, as we continue to align ourselves with the positive causes we wish to create, we will begin to see the effects manifest in our lives. One of the most powerful tools for aligning ourselves with the law of cause and effect is the practice of intentionality. Intentionality is the conscious setting of an intention or goal, combined with the commitment to take actions that are in alignment with that intention. When we set an intention, we are planting a seed in the fertile soil of the universe, and when we take aligned actions, we are watering that seed and giving it the nourishment it needs to grow. Over time, as we continue to nurture our intentions through our thoughts, actions, and emotions, they will begin to manifest in our reality. It is also important to recognize that the law of cause and effect operates on both the individual and the collective level. The causes we set in motion, whether positive or negative, not only affect our own lives, but also the lives of those around us and the world as a whole. This is why it is so important to act with integrity, kindness, and compassion. Our actions, thoughts, and emotions are not isolated events, they are part of a larger web of interconnectedness that binds all beings together. When we act with love and kindness, we contribute to the creation of a more loving and compassionate world. Conversely, when we act from a place of fear, anger, or selfishness, we contribute to the perpetuation of suffering and division. In this way, the law of cause and effect teaches us that we are not powerless in the face of the challenges and difficulties we encounter in life. On the contrary, we have the power to shape our reality through the choices we make and the actions we take. This understanding brings with it a sense of empowerment and responsibility. It reminds us that we are not victims of circumstance but active participants in the creation of our own reality. As we align ourselves with the law of cause and effect, we begin to see the world in a new light. We recognize that every thought, every action, and every intention has the power to shape our reality and the reality of those around us. We become conscious creators, capable of influencing the course of our lives and the world in ways that reflect our highest intentions and deepest desires. This is the gift of understanding and working with this metaphysical law, the ability to step into our power as creators and to live a life that is aligned with our highest purpose. In conclusion, as we reflect on the law of cause and effect, we can see that it is not merely a rule of the physical universe, but a profound metaphysical principle that governs the very fabric of our reality. It teaches us that we are not passive recipients of life's events, but active participants in the creation of our experiences. Through our thoughts, actions, and emotions, we send ripples into the universe that shape the outcomes we encounter. By becoming conscious of the causes we set in motion and aligning ourselves with positive intentions, we can create a reality that reflects our highest aspirations. This is the power of the law of cause and effect, the power to shape our destiny and to live a life of purpose, meaning, and fulfillment. Chapter 3 Energy and Consciousness The concept of energy and consciousness is one of the most profound and transformative elements in metaphysical thought. 
It offers a deeper understanding of not only the forces that shape our reality but also the interconnectedness of all things. When we speak of energy in this context, we are not referring to the physical energy of movement or heat, but rather the vibrational essence that underlies all existence, the life force that flows through every living being, object, an event in the universe. This energy is often called prana in Eastern traditions or kai in Chinese philosophy, but its essence remains the same across different cultures and spiritual systems, it is the subtle, unseen force that connects everything in the cosmos. At the heart of understanding this energy is the realization that consciousness and energy are inseparable, they are two sides of the same coin. Consciousness directs energy, and energy is the expression of consciousness. Imagine for a moment that you are a radio tower, constantly transmitting and receiving frequencies. The thoughts you think, the emotions you feel, and the beliefs you hold all vibrate at specific frequencies, sending signals out into the universe. These signals interact with the vibrational frequencies of other people, places, and events, creating a complex web of energetic interactions that shape the reality you experience. This is not a mystical idea, but a fundamental principle of how the universe operates on a metaphysical level. Just as a radio tunes into specific stations based on the frequency it is set to, you are constantly tuning into and interacting with the frequencies around you. The key to transforming your life lies in understanding this energy and learning how to consciously direct it. One of the first steps in mastering the relationship between energy and consciousness is recognizing that everything you experience is, in essence, a reflection of your energetic state. When you are in a state of fear, anxiety, or anger, your energy vibrates at a lower frequency and you are more likely to attract experiences that match that vibration. You may find yourself surrounded by negativity, conflict, or obstacles, and it may feel as though the world is against you. But in reality, the external world is merely reflecting the internal vibration you are emitting. Conversely, when you are in a state of love, joy, and gratitude, your energy vibrates at a higher frequency and you attract experiences that resonate with those elevated states of being. This understanding is not about blaming yourself for the challenges you face, but about empowering yourself to change your energetic state and, in turn, the reality you experience. The key to raising your vibrational frequency lies in elevating your consciousness. Consciousness, in this context, refers to your awareness of your thoughts, emotions, and beliefs, as well as your understanding of the interconnected nature of all things. When your consciousness is focused on fear, lack, and separation, your energy will reflect those lower vibrations. However, when your consciousness is rooted in love, abundance, and unity, your energy will rise to match those higher states. This is why practices such as meditation, mindfulness, and intentional living are so important in the metaphysical journey. These practices help you become more aware of your inner world and allow you to consciously choose the thoughts and emotions that align with the reality you wish to create. Energy, in its essence, is neutral, it is neither good nor bad. It is simply the raw material of the universe, waiting to be directed by consciousness. This is why understanding the role of intention is so crucial. Your intentions are like the blueprint for the energy you direct. When you set a clear and positive intention, you give direction to the energy you are working with, guiding it toward the outcomes you desire. However, if your intentions are unclear, scattered, or rooted in fear, the energy you direct will reflect that confusion and chaos. Learning to set clear, focused, and positive intentions is one of the most powerful tools you have in shaping your reality. This is where the concept of energy flows where attention goes comes into play. Whatever you focus your consciousness on, whether it is a goal, a dream, or a fear, your energy will flow in that direction and begin to manifest in your reality. Consider for a moment the power of focused attention. In everyday life, we often scatter our energy across many different tasks, worries, and desires. Our attention is divided, and as a result, our energy is diffused. 
But when we bring our full attention to a single intention or goal, we concentrate our energy, creating a powerful force that can shape reality in profound ways. This is why practices such as visualization and affirmation are so effective in manifesting desired outcomes. When you visualize a goal with clarity and focus, you are aligning your consciousness with the energy of that goal, tuning your vibrational frequency to match it. The more vividly you can see, feel, and believe in the outcome, the more energy you direct toward its manifestation. This is not simply a matter of wishful thinking, but a deliberate act of aligning your energy with the reality you wish to create. However, it is important to recognize that energy and consciousness are not static. They are in constant motion, always shifting and changing in response to our thoughts, emotions, and external circumstances. This is why maintaining a high vibrational state requires ongoing practice and awareness. It is easy to slip into lower vibrational states when we are faced with challenges, stress, or negativity, but the key is to recognize when this happens and take steps to realign our energy. Practices such as breath work, meditation, and spending time in nature are powerful tools for resetting your energy and raising your vibration. These practices help you reconnect with the present moment, release negative energy, and tap into the higher frequencies of peace, love, and gratitude. Another important aspect of working with energy and consciousness is understanding the role of emotions. Emotions are a direct reflection of your energetic state. When you feel emotions such as joy, love, and excitement, your energy is flowing freely and vibrantly. But when you feel emotions such as fear, anger, or sadness, your energy becomes blocked or constricted. This is why emotional awareness is so crucial in the metaphysical journey. By becoming aware of your emotions and learning to process and release negative feelings, you can free up your energy and raise your vibrational frequency. Emotions are not something to be suppressed or ignored, they are valuable indicators of your energetic state and provide important information about where your attention and consciousness are focused. One of the most powerful tools for raising your vibrational frequency is the practice of gratitude. Gratitude shifts your focus away from what is lacking or wrong in your life and directs your energy toward what is abundant and good. This shift in focus raises your vibrational frequency and opens you up to receive more of what you appreciate. Gratitude is a magnetic force that attracts more of the experiences and feelings you are grateful for. When you cultivate a mindset of gratitude, you align your consciousness with the energy of abundance, and the universe responds by bringing more of that abundance into your life. This is not just a feel-good practice, it is a profound metaphysical tool for creating the life you desire. Another key aspect of working with energy and consciousness is understanding the concept of alignment. Alignment refers to the harmonious flow of energy between your thoughts, emotions, beliefs, and actions. When you are in alignment, your energy flows smoothly and effortlessly, and you experience a sense of ease and flow in your life. This is often referred to as being in the zone or in flow state. When you are out of alignment, however, your energy becomes blocked or scattered, leading to feelings of frustration, resistance, and struggle. Alignment is not something that happens by chance, it is a deliberate practice of tuning your energy to match your highest intentions and desires. One of the most common ways people become misaligned is by holding beliefs or thoughts that contradict their desires. For example, you may have a desire for financial abundance, but if you hold beliefs such as money is hard to come by or I don't deserve to be wealthy, you are creating a vibrational dissonance between your desire and your energy. This dissonance blocks the flow of energy toward your goal, making it difficult to manifest the outcome you want. The key to realignment is identifying and releasing these contradictory beliefs and thoughts, replacing them with beliefs that are in harmony with your desires. This process requires deep introspection and honesty, as it often involves confronting limiting beliefs that may have been ingrained in you for years. As you continue to work with energy and consciousness, you will begin to notice the subtle shifts that occur in your life as a result of your energetic alignment. 
you may find that synchronicities, opportunities, and resources flow to you more easily. You may experience a greater sense of inner peace and clarity, as well as a heightened ability to manifest your desires. This is not magic or coincidence, it is the natural result of aligning your consciousness and energy with the flow of the universe. When you are in alignment, you are in harmony with the natural laws of the universe, and your life becomes a reflection of that harmony. It is also important to recognize that working with energy and consciousness is not just about personal transformation, it is about contributing to the collective energy of the world. Each of us is a part of the greater whole, and the energy we emit influences the collective consciousness. When you raise your vibrational frequency, you are not only improving your own life, but also contributing to the upliftment of the entire planet. This is why practices such as meditation, prayer, and acts of kindness are so powerful, not only do they raise your own vibration, but they also send positive energy into the world, creating a ripple effect that benefits all beings. In conclusion, understanding the relationship between energy and consciousness is a transformative journey that opens up new possibilities for personal and collective growth. By becoming aware of your energetic state, raising your vibration, and aligning your consciousness with your highest intentions, you can create a life that is in harmony with the flow of the universe. This journey requires ongoing practice, patience, and a willingness to look deeply at your thoughts, emotions, and beliefs. But as you continue to work with energy and consciousness, you will begin to experience the profound changes that come from living in alignment with the natural laws of the universe. This is the true power of metaphysics, the ability to shape your reality through the conscious direction of your energy and awareness. Conclusion As you journey through life, there comes a point when you begin to see that every experience, every interaction, and every moment is interconnected by invisible threads that link your inner world with the outer reality. It is a realization that transcends the boundaries of traditional thinking, allowing you to step into a broader, more profound understanding of existence. This understanding comes from an awareness that reality is not something that happens to you, rather, it is something that you co-create with every thought, belief, emotion, and intention. The ancient wisdom of metaphysics, which has been passed down through countless generations, offers a framework for understanding this co-creative process and applying it in a way that transforms not only how you experience life but also how you shape it. In recognizing the role that perception plays in shaping reality, you gain a sense of agency that few ever tap into. The world, as it appears, is not a static, objective phenomenon. It is, in fact, constantly molded by the lens through which you view it. When you understand that perception is not just a passive process, but an active one, you begin to realize the extent of your influence over your own experiences. The way you perceive the events in your life, the meanings you assign to them, and the stories you tell yourself about those events all contribute to the reality you experience. This understanding liberates you from the notion that life is happening to you opening your eyes to the truth that life is happening through you. Every situation, whether joyful or challenging, carries within it the seeds of growth and transformation, depending on how you choose to perceive and respond to it. The law of cause and effect further deepens your understanding of this interconnectedness. You come to see that nothing in life happens in isolation, every action, thought, an emotion sets into motion a series of causes that eventually ripple back into your experience. This law teaches you the importance of intentionality in everything you do. By aligning your actions and thoughts with positive, constructive intentions, you set in motion a flow of energy that brings about outcomes in harmony with your highest desires. It is a reminder that you are not merely reacting to life, but actively participating in its unfolding. The causes you set in motion today may not bear fruit immediately, but they inevitably shape the course of your future, much like a gardener planting seeds that will one day grow into a flourishing garden. The law of cause and effect empowers you to take ownership of your life, knowing that the seeds you plant today will determine the harvest you reap tomorrow. As you delve into the deeper layers of metaphysical understanding, the role of energy and consciousness becomes increasingly clear. 
Everything in the universe, from the smallest particle to the grandest galaxy, is composed of energy. This energy vibrates at different frequencies, and these vibrations create the reality you experience. Your consciousness, the very essence of your being, is the driver of this energy. The thoughts you think, the emotions you feel, and the beliefs you hold all carry specific energetic frequencies that resonate with similar frequencies in the universe. When your consciousness is aligned with high vibrational states such as love, gratitude, and joy, you naturally attract experiences that resonate with those frequencies. Conversely, when your consciousness is dominated by lower vibrations like fear, anger, or doubt, you draw experiences that reflect those states of being. This understanding of energy and consciousness puts the power of creation firmly in your hands. You are not at the mercy of external forces, but rather, you are a co-creator with the universe, shaping your reality moment by moment through the energy you emit. As you reflect on the journey you've taken through the principles of metaphysics, a profound truth emerges, you have always had the power within you to shape your reality. The teachings of perception, cause and effect, and energy and consciousness are not just abstract ideas, they are practical tools that, when applied consistently, can transform every aspect of your life. Whether you are seeking greater peace, deeper relationships, financial abundance, or personal fulfillment, these principles offer a roadmap for creating the life you desire. It is not a matter of wishing for change and waiting for it to happen, it is about consciously engaging with the forces that shape your reality and directing them in a way that aligns with your highest vision. This understanding does not imply that life will be without challenges. On the contrary, challenges are an inevitable part of the human experience. However, with this deeper metaphysical awareness, you begin to see challenges in a new light. Instead of viewing them as obstacles to be feared or avoided, you recognize them as opportunities for growth and expansion. Every challenge carries within it a lesson, a gift that, once understood, propels you to a higher level of consciousness. The challenges you face are not random, they are intricately woven into the fabric of your personal evolution, each one offering a chance to refine your understanding of these metaphysical principles and apply them in increasingly sophisticated ways. The more you embrace these challenges with an open heart and a curious mind, the more you will discover the transformative power that lies within you. In this process of self-discovery and personal evolution, you also come to realize the importance of compassion, both for yourself and for others. As you navigate the complexities of life, there will be moments when you fall into lower vibrations, when doubt or fear clouds your vision. In these moments, it is essential to practice self-compassion, to recognize that you are a work in progress, constantly growing and evolving. Likewise, as you encounter others who may be struggling with their own challenges, you develop a deeper sense of empathy, knowing that we are all on our own unique journeys, each learning the lessons we need to grow. This compassion creates a ripple effect, sending out waves of love and understanding that contribute to the collective elevation of consciousness. Ultimately, the journey of metaphysical exploration is one that leads to profound personal empowerment. You begin to see yourself not as a passive recipient of life's events, but as a powerful creator, capable of shaping your reality through your thoughts, beliefs, and intentions. This realization brings with it a sense of freedom and possibility. No longer are you bound by the limitations of old belief systems or conditioned patterns of thought. Instead, you are free to imagine and create a life that reflects your highest potential. This is the gift of metaphysics, the ability to transcend the ordinary and step into the extraordinary, to move beyond the limitations of the material world and tap into the infinite possibilities that lie within the realm of consciousness. As you continue on this path, remember that the journey is ongoing. There is always more to discover, more to learn, and more to experience. Each day presents a new opportunity to apply these metaphysical principles, to refine your understanding, and to expand your consciousness. The more you engage with these ideas, the more you will find that life becomes a beautiful, unfolding mystery, 
filled with wonder, growth, and transformation. The power to create the life you desire is already within you, waiting to be unlocked through the conscious application of these timeless truths. And as you walk this path, know that you are not alone, there is a vast, interconnected web of energy and consciousness supporting you, guiding you, and co-creating with you every step of the way.